Most people will tell you they dread the paperwork and long lines at the DMV. Consumer experts tell us people need to be alert if they come across websites that promise convenience. Some of the sites are after your personal information and aren't affiliated with the state. Having to make a trip to the DMV office can give some people a headache. I don't want to go, I don't want to wait in line, I don't want to have to deal with all the paperwork, I don't want to have to deal with being told that I uh, have the wrong information. We met Clayton Hill outside a DMV office in El Paso County. He just moved here from Arkansas and says he understands why some people will go searching online for ways to avoid the visit altogether. I'd rather do it online, really. It's all right there in my house and I can just, if I need something, just go and get it instead of having to drive back and forth. Consumer experts say the desire to take care of DMV issues on the web comes with a risk. The Better Business Bureau says scammers are lurking online, waiting for people to share sensitive information like social security numbers. It does create that space, unfortunately, for people to get taken advantage of because if you knew that the last time you renewed your license, it took you three hours in line, then you had to go home and get an additional document, couldn't call anyone on the phone, um, the next time it comes up, it's very easy for you to Google and say, is there another way to do this? The BBB is investigating websites like ColoradoDLGuide.org where people are giving up both credit card and personal information and even paying for what they think are DMV services, even though the site has no affiliation with the state. You never know what someone does with your personal information. So unfortunately, there could be illegal activity happening, um, but definitely ethically and definitely um, dishonest. The El Paso County Clerk's Office mirrors that concern as citizens are reporting landing on different websites that appear before legitimate ones in online search results. They're targeting people who don't, they're like lazy, don't want to really, like me, I guess, who don't want to get out and, uh, you know, deal with the, the hassle and all that. So, I mean, I guess it's, um, you just got to be wary of all that. The state has two official vehicle registration websites, mydmv.colorado.gov and colorado.gov slash DMV. Those are the websites citizens should use for online motor vehicle services. We've posted those links on our website, koaa.com. Always watching out for you, Patrick Nelson, News 5 Investigates.